poppin' my YouTubers? Uh, I just want to give everyone a huge thank you for keeping up with us. Uh, from when it first started on Snapchat to now Instagram and now to our finally our own YouTube channel. Um, our video right now, I had a video of me and Coleman in the car when we were introducing each other, but for some reason it's not letting me edit it. It's like saying error error every time and I tried transferring it to my laptop still not working either I think it's just the way I recorded it I guess something was wrong with my phone when I first recorded it but we're gonna do our own videos I guess I'm gonna start off first then I'm gonna make Coleman do a video make him send it to me and then we'll go from there um but my name is Cynthia obviously some of you guys that are gonna keep up with us know me already um I'm the brains in the group, I guess I would say. I'm the one that comes up with the weird ideas. I'm the one that came up with this whole thing. Uh, Coleman's the one that actually agreed with it. Um, but Coleman also is the brains. He's the one that sometimes is like, oh, Cynthia, record this. Or like, I'll start recording. He's like, Cynthia, you're too much. And I'm like, okay, I'm sorry. I'm like, I don't know what to do. But we want to thank you guys so, so much for keeping up with us. Like, it actually means quite a lot. I don't know if I'm repeating this, but if I am, I'm sorry about that. I'm just extremely happy about this. Um, Coleman and I have been through quite a lot. I met Coleman in junior high at St. Paul's High School. Uh, we've known each other for seven, eight years, I think. I don't remember. But something around those <laughs> those numbers. Um, Coleman and I stopped talking after I, went, I moved to St. Pat's. So I left everyone basically at St. Paul's. I only kept talking to my cousin Joey. Uh, I think that was the only person that I would talk to from that school. Uh, then graduation came, I went to Algonquin, I'm in Police Foundations. Uh, I was hanging out with an old friend buddy of mine because there was like a couple of people in my class that I knew from St. Paul's and it was actually pretty dope. Uh, but then we went to the Tim Hortons there and I saw Coleman and at first I was kind of awkward because I was like I know there's something between us but I'm not too sure like I'll just play it off type thing so I did um turns out he actually apologized to me for what he did on uh, in junior high it was like something stupid I don't know why but at that time I didn't remember what it was so I just like ignored it I'm like yeah yeah whatever you know like I went with it I was like yeah it's okay don't worry about it like we were kids blah 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 but once he actually told me why he apologized, I was like, oh my, yeah, you did. But now it's like, whatever. But ever since Coleman and I started talking again, we've had like our ups and downs, but it's not because of me and him. Let's just say people just try to break the connection that me and him have as friends. Um, but we went, we broke it out. We talked about it. We laid everything out on the table, basically, and now we're fine. Um, I seriously do not know where I would be if this kid was not back in my life, to be honest. He's helped me quite a lot. I've helped him quite a lot. We're both each other's, like, teeter-totter. So, like, if one of us are down, the other one will go up. And, like, it's like a balance, basically. When we're having a good day, that balance board just stays straight. And it's actually quite a amazing. Like, we've gone through so many crazy things. You guys that have basically watched our snapchat videos you've seen all our crazy nights at Maison, uh, Mardi Gras, uh, when we just hung out after work and stuff like that from like us living together for two weeks which is actually the most dopest thing ever but this kid is actually like the most insane kid ever like I love this kid so much um, he actually brightens up my day like if I'm having a shit day or like I'm stressing at work I'll text him and I'll be like bro this is happening and he'll be like bro me too and I'm like okay let's talk about it so we'll fix everything and then we'll be fine um, but this kid has just been like crazily supportive and helpful throughout my life just like how I've been to him and that's what I like about it but I just want to let you guys know that uh, we're just we're super excited like I don't even know what to say but we're just super excited for this channel uh, I want to let everyone know that uh, once we start hitting like a certain quantity to the where we want to be uh, Coleman and I will start making merchandise uh, we'll make cute little keychains uh, sweaters that have keeping up with the returns at the back and then like a dirt ass pictures on both sides um, Coleman doesn't know about this part, but I've been like thinking about it and like basically like taking pictures of it and thinking about it. Um, but 
we need your help on your end. Uh, anyone who's a photographer, a video recorder, uh, who l wants to like basically, like Coleman and I are basically helping people see what they want. So if you if you have a phot uh, photographer, wow, <laughs> if you have a camera and you just want to like take shots and stuff like that, come with us. We'll show you places that we want to take pictures and you guys can help us out. Uh, video recorder, you guys can support us by coming with us on our adventures and obviously I'll give you guys a huge shout out and you guys will get credit out of this. Um, we just want to help people find what they want in life and we want you guys to help us grow basically. Um, we are just like, like I said, we're, we're the two duos that like to help people grow and see people grow. We do not like to see people go down to their bottom to where they don't know where they're supposed to be. Uh, Coleman and I have been literally to the lowest point in life where we didn't even know what to do with ourselves anymore and we helped each other get back up. Uh, I think it first started with me, I was like really at my lowest, like really lowest, like I didn't know what to do anymore, like I was panicking, I was having a lot of stress attacks and stuff like that and anxiety attacks um, just because I didn't know what I wanted like and Coleman helped me a lot, open up my eyes to see where I wanted to be and I've helped him and I still help him to this day. He still has like those rough edges and so do I, but we always keep ourselves up. But like I said, if you guys are here to help us, we're here to help you and we're super stoked. I can't wait to see what you guys want us to, ah, I can't wait to see what you guys want us to do uh, when it comes to challenges and videos like that. Uh, like, please don't give us life-threatening challenges like that freaking detergent thing that started up not too long ago. Uh, I saw that I think two days ago it was I saw it or something like that but it's the most stupidest challenge ever please don't make us do dumb challenges uh, if I do see any like life-threatening challenges or anything like that I will just ignore the comments and just keep up with the other ones that I know that are good um, I'm pretty sure our next video is gonna be a bean boozle challenge so after that you guys can request other ones and you guys can let me know what else you want to see but like I said I'll leave our Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook at the bottom. Uh, please like, subscribe, share the video, guys. Leave your comments below. Show this video out to everyone. I want this video to go as far as it can. And I know you guys can help us with this. Thanks, guys, so much for keeping up with the retards. And I hope to see you guys soon. Bye.